So far, so good. Started putting up the advent calendar. What do you think, Jenny? You like it? <laughs> Me too. Okay, the advent calendar is up on the wall. There it is. So I'm just going to put a couple of Lindsay's treats in here. Day one, lint bowl. I don't pre... I don't pre-stuff the stockings with chocolate because otherwise I'd just eat it. <coughs> True. So this is Lindsay's for the first plop and the third. Put it in that way. <coughs> We're in business. What did you get, Jetty? <gasps> oh, is it a lint bowl? Yum, yum, yum. You know where it goes, don't you? Trade in the gob. Oh. Daddy's gob. He's not for Jetty. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> to put up the tree, Jetty. There it is. Can you play some Christmas music? Mm. Okay. Good job. Good morning everyone. Today is Monday the 3rd of December which means that on the weekend we finally decorated our place for Christmas. It has a little bit of a minimalist vibe here so I'm going to show you what it looks like. There's not too much clutter around but just a little bit to give it a bit of Christmas magic. So let's just go to the front. Reversing to the front. And I'll show you what's going on in here. My son's just having a nap at the moment. Oh, phew, hit the door. Um, okay, so I'm gonna turn the camera around now and I'll show you. So, this is our place from the front door. Just a few little Christmassy touches. So down here, oh, let me show you first. front door we have our nice wreath shame about the screen door kind of detracts from the style but not to worry um, let's see here so I'm very excited about what's going on here these are our Christmas stockings this is Lindsay's it's new that one's mine it's new this one's Jed's I've actually had that one for a few years, but I thought that one would suit him best. We actually haven't done Christmas stockings, Lindsay and I, before, and I've been having so much fun finding stocking stuffers for him. And I'm gonna do a Christmas gift guide in my next video. So I am excited to show you what I've been getting. So I got these from Aldi. They were about $6 bargain for these really quality knitted stockings. And I've just tied them onto this railing with some ribbon here. And then up here, we have our advent calendar. This is the one that Lindsay and I have been using for a few years. I actually bought this one from Coles. And we just fill it up with little treats that we find for one another like chocolates lollies scratchies little little like notes for one another like a voucher for a massage things like that and then up here this is another little thing that we like to do it's a bit of an american thing but we have adopted it as our own in this house we have this little thing, kiss under the mistletoe, and yeah, we use that in December. And then here I have my husband's advent calendar that I bought for him. So over here in our 
entry table. I have this cool little combi van with the tree on top. Um, so then over here we have the reindeer with the little bells on. And moving on to the tree. This is our Christmas tree that we got new this year from Target. So we wanted the snowy aspen from Target, but apparently it became a bit of a cult item and it sold out across Australia. So we got the blue aspen. Now this one was only $59 total bargain. It's pretty good for what it is. You know, it doesn't look like a nasty cheapie or anything. So I showed you this decoration that I got for Jed as his first decoration, but I ended up going with this one. Um, it says, oops, can you see that? Baby's first Christmas. And uh, got a few other little cuties on there. This one is my favorite that Lindsay bought for me a few years ago. So cute. And then over here on our kitchen table, I made this tablecloth. Uh, it has little koalas, cute little Christmas theme. I went with this pink one because I just wanted something, you know, bright and fun and a little bit girly, to be honest. Now, one more thing I want to show you, this candle over here, this Akoya candle is called uh, fresh pine needles and it's so good if you guys have an artificial tree like us i highly recommend this candle from akoya because it it smells so good it really does smell like a real christmas tree so if you've got an artificial one you can just have your candle and no one will ever know that you've got a fake tree pretty much it for our christmas decorations as I said, it is quite minimalist and I might need a couple of extra things to be honest, but at the moment it's nice and simple and good for a house with a baby in it. So I hope you enjoyed this video and as I mentioned before, I'm going to do a gift buying guide in my next video. I finished my Christmas shopping pretty much yesterday. I've got quite a few things to show you and ideas to give you if you're stuck for ideas for various family members, but I'll get into that in the next video. So thank you very much for watching and please hit like if you liked the video, leave me a comment and hit subscribe if you'd like to see more. I'll talk to you soon, bye.